Hey guys, today this video is going to show you how to make this sushi. For this project, I have four different designs. I already have video for this sushi roll and the sushi with shrimp on it. And this tooth, this one is egg and meat. These tooth are the same design, just different color on the top. And today I'm going to show you how to make this one. And if you want to make meat, you just change egg from yellow to red and you become meat. For this project, we're going to set our room has a little bit here and keep your red arrows point away from you. First, we're going to make the rice on the bottom. For the rice, I'm going to use two bands. Start from first on the center to first on your left. Two. First to second on your left. Two. Second to third on your left. Two, from third on your left, comes into the center. Now we're going to repeat this step and do it on your right. Two, first on the center to first on your right. First to second on your right. Second to third. From third on your right, comes into the center. Two, first to second on the center, second to third, and third to fourth. Now we're going to take one single band, twist, one, two. So you will see three rings here. Place right here as cap band. Now we're going to rotate our loom and start looping. Grab the first two, go to the next one. Bottom two, go to the next one. Bottom two, go to the next one. Now we're going to look for the next two. Grab it and hook it to your left. Bottom two, get to the next one. Bottom two, get to the next one. Now last one, we're gonna grab it and hook it to the last one on the center. Now we're gonna come back here, grab the bottom two, hook it to your right. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Look at the last one on the center. Now we're going to put our hook through all the bands here. Take one single band, grab it, put both ends on your hook, take one end through the others, pull it, so you will tie a knot here. And now it's time to take it off. This is our rice on the bottom. Now we're going to hide this secure band. Since this is the bottom, so you can hide it anywhere. You won't see it. Just put your hook through some of the band close by. Grab it through, tuck it underneath. And you can squeeze it in a little bit. Now we're going to make the top part. If you want to make egg, use yellow. If you want to make meat, use red. For the egg part, I'm only going to use single band to draw the whole piece. The same, we're going to start with red arrows point away from you. Single band, first on the center to first on your left. First to second on your left. Second to third on your left. Third on your left to fourth on the center. Now repeat this step and do it on your right. First on the center to first on your right. First to second on your right. Second to third on your right. Third on your right 
to force on the center. First to second on the center, second to third, and third to fourth. Now I'm going to take one single band, twist, one, two. So you will see three rings here. Place right here, a skip band. Now I'm going to rotate our loom and start looping. Grab the first one, hold on to your cap band, hook it to the next one. This band is where it comes from, so we're going to hook it back to where it comes from. Grab the bottom one, hook it to the next one, bottom one, hook it to the next one. Come back here, now we're going to look for this band, it should be the next one. Hook it to your left, bottom one, hook it to the next one, bottom one, next one. Bottom one, hook it to the last one on the center. Now come back here. Grab the last one, hook it to your right. Bottom one, hook it to the next one. Bottom one, hook it to the next one. Bottom one, hook it to the last one on the center. Now put your hook to take one single band, grab it through, put both ends on your hook, take one end to the others, pull it, so you tie a knot here. Now it's time to take it out. Now this is our A. The same, we're going to hide this secure band anywhere close by. Put your hook through some of the band. Grab it through, tuck it underneath. Now we got our A. Now we're going to take these two pieces, put them together like this, so you'll be two layer. Now we're going to take four of the black band and wrap it around, so you, this will be the seaweed part. So we're going to take four black, you can use your finger, open it up, and just wrap it around. Now after you put your bands in there, we want to straighten them out. We don't want to be overlap with each other. That way it will look nicer. And this is our sushi with egg on it. You can change color to make me. And also check out my other video for shrimp and sushi roll. Thank you for watching. See you next time.